Look, the president's been very clear. It's not Republicans that have stood in the way of this nomination uh, of all of these qualified individuals. It's been Democrats that have stalled over and over again, not attending hearings, trying to use every delay tactic possible. It's those people that have a problem. Um, and I think that's the, the, the message that the party has missed uh, on the Democratic side, which, which – and I don't think that – wouldn't paint it with a broad brush, because I think it's Senate Democrats, frankly, that haven't gotten the message. Our team has been in contact with all with with the entire Senate uh, team okay. to make sure that they understand that they've had visits as requested. Uh, but we have been in constant contact with the with the Senate, the members of the Senate, their staffs, our legislative affairs team has had an extremely robust uh, schedule of meetings with their teams um, to make these these nominees available to them. Um, but I think the broader issue again, and and with all due respect, I think it's interesting that we're focusing on the votes of two Republicans when you look at the the spectrum of, of antics that have gone on in the Democrats. I mean, the tactics that they have done over and over and over again to delay, not show up to hearings, uh, you know, do filibuster to the extent that they can, run the clock out. It's not Republicans that have a problem here, Alexis. It's the Democrats that continue to do this.